everybody, uh, James Akers here, the tie guy. Today we're going to be tying and reviewing a Salvatore Ferragamo tie. Um, this is one of my favorite ties just because it's a really cool look. Uh, I did put some pictures uh, up close of it on my Instagram. I'm going to try to get in here where you can see it. This camera uh, sometimes does do real good close up. It's actually swans riding a bicycle is what the, the uh, content of the tie is. It's a really pretty shade of like a light blue. So we'll be pairing that today with a very light pink, like an almost white shirt and a blue suit, uh, not a real dark blue, a lighter blue suit. And uh, we're going to see all that that uh, comes together here in just a minute. Uh, going with a uh, gray or a gunmetal belt buckle and a pair of brown shoes with a brown belt. Um, because uh, the, the colors are going to be bright enough, I don't need a bright like a gold belt buckle with this. Uh, with this. As far as a Salvatore Ferragamo tie, um, they're almost all the same when you come to Ferragamo. Ferragamo is a thinner tie, uh, see if you can see here, it's a pretty thin silk. Um, ties a very uh, nice tight knot. Um, I don't know what Ferragamo does different with his silk or where he gets the silk from, but um, most thin silk ties, when you tie a knot, the knot comes loose um, through the day. You have to keep adjusting it. Uh, Ferragamo silk, you tie a tie, it just stays there. So uh, I probably have more Ferragamo ties than the others in my collection. Uh, I'm guessing I haven't done an actual count. I've got all kinds of ties. But um, uh, I just like the way they feel. Super, super soft silk. That's the other thing. Most thin ties are, are not quite as soft uh, as this. Um, now, Brooks Brothers has a tie that uses Italian silk that's made in America that has a similar look and feel to a Ferragamo. Um, uh, it's a lot cheaper as well, but the knot comes undone through the day. We'll be doing a review of a Brooks Brothers tie on another video. But let's tie this up and see what it looks like. Now, with Ferragamo, I, I tie them so often that I pretty much know where they need to be as far as um, you know the length and stuff goes. I know with the Ferragamo tie, I'm going to be right around here uh, lengthwise. So we're going to tie this baby up, see what it looks like. Uh, first, we take the long part. Whoops, I didn't get my collar up there. We take the long part, and make sure I got my, my feel here. Long part over top, over the top, and then we come back and under and through. Then we take the long part back behind, keeping everything flat, up, over, and through. And now we're going to do a checkpoint, make sure the knot's coming along good, and it is coming along just fine. Um, then we take the, the long part again over the front. This creates what I call the pocket right here. And we come behind, up and over, and then we take it through that little pocket. Hold the top of the pocket and pull the tie through. Now we get to this point, the tie is starting to come together, but we take and hold the knot. And we pull the long part of the tie to tighten the knot, and then the short part to raise it up. And we put the collar down and see what this looks like. Yeah, it just has such a nice, clean knot. Um, these are great ties, especially when you're wearing like a but, uh, button-down collar or a small collar because you've got, um, they tie such a nice, tight knot. Um, now I've got my bit of my ties coming down about halfway down my belt buckle. That's where I want it to be. I'm going to take the back and we're going to tuck it through the little strap on the back. Let's take a look at this. Very happy with how that came together there. Let's put the suit coat on see what this looks like. Then we'll go over the look with you. Look should be scrolling across the bottom of the screen. Okay, so we have um, an Amarna Zinnia blue suit. Uh, the shirt today I'm wearing is also a Zinnia, Myrna Jill Zinnia. Um, so we have a Zinnia suit, uh, you know, pants and, and jacket matching. And then uh, we have a Salvatore Ferragamo tie, belt, and shoes. I'm going with a pair of, uh, I don't know if you can see them on here or not, Salvatore Ferragamo brown dress shoes. They don't quite perfectly match the belt, but it's close enough that it works. I don't have that exact same color in, in a belt. But um, blue, pink, blue with brown accents. And then I'm going to pair this with a blue strapped watch. Uh, this is going to look really good together whenever I put this on here in just a few minutes after I finish getting ready. And now I'm ready for work. <laughs> 